Hello everyone! Welcome to Rooted and Real. In this video, I want to do an unboxing with you. I have these two packages. You want to see what's inside? <laughs> okay, uh, we'll start with this one. I ordered from Amazon and I got a lot of like crafting stuff and organizational things. So this one is washi tape, but it is planner washi tape. We'll get that out and look at it in detail soon. And this is a dotted journal set. This was on special. So it was, I think about 60% off. I've got plans. I've got big plans for this stuff. I wasn't sure how big everything was going to be because, you know, pictures. But let's look. We have 15 fine liners. Six washi tapes. A pen, stickers, and stencils. And the journal We have two ribbons. And the elastic closure. Pen holder here on the side. Nope, oh, if I can. There we go. The cover feels nice and sturdy. And all of the pages are dotted. bullet journal. I'm excited. It is thicker than I thought. In the pictures online, I was a little nervous about how thin it was going to be, but this is a good size. 220 usable dotted pages. This is going to be put to good use. Let's look at the washi tape. These little blocks. 
Okay, I'm gonna have to tear it. I don't wanna tear it. How are you supposed to? Okay. There's the patterns for the washi tape. Which I think go really cute with the yellow of this. We're just going to do a quick look. I'll do another video where we go in detail because I am going to plan on YouTube so that we can do it together. This will be my first official bullet journal planner. I'm excited to be more organized. These are the colors. Okay, so that is that. Let's stick it in here. Now the big package. I may need to use my new pen. Hopefully I don't mess it up. Da, da, da. Okay, let's set it over here and pull it out. This is marker paper. I stumbled across this when I was looking for tracing paper and vellum. And I did not know that there was actual marker paper. I am going to experiment with this and see what I come up with. I'll show you how it works out when I try it. Sticker set. We'll open this. I'll show you what it looks like. I'm curious to see. They are transparent. <gasps> They're not. Oh my goodness, y'all. I swear when I ordered these, they're supposed to be transparent, like washi stickers. And it is totally not. I have to go back and look at the description because I don't know if I read it wrong or if it's advertised incorrectly. That's disappointing. I don't want the white outline. These are stencils to go along with my bullet journaling. That is a lot. Cute. It's 
So that's the gist of it. We will go more detail. Oh. I've been waiting to open these because I wanted to show you as I did it. There's a double-sided tape runner. This is for my vacuum cleaner. I need a belt. That's not for journaling. Scrapbook pack and scrapbook papers, Bible tabs. I got blue. This is gonna go on my blue Bible. So these, this is origami paper. I came across this looking for scrapbook packs and it's cheaper than the scrapbook packs. Now granted, the scrapbook pack has stickers and some other things in it, which we'll look at in a second. But you know the little uh, pads that have the paper, the pretty paper? This is cheaper than the ones that were this size. These are six by six and they have pads six by six that's uh, bound at the top that you use for scrapbooking and whatnot. But this was cheaper. I got two packs. It's double sided. It's origami paper. So it's thinner than the scrapbook paper, but there's a bunch of pretty ones. So this one is mostly flowers. And if you can look at that, those are the patterns in this pack. And the other one, same thing, double-sided. And these are the patterns in this pack. I think it'll work better, actually, in the Bible journaling because it's thin. It's just like regular paper. So it won't make the journals, whether I put it in the regular journal or Bible journaling, it's not gonna thicken it up so much. So I like that. comes in these envelopes and I immediately thought I can use that envelope for something okay everything is in it oh definitely definitely going in for the Bible journal <laughs> I can put that down and this will be a pocket in the journal. All right, I got a use for the envelope it comes in. Stickers. More stickers, 
we'll go through these better later. And tiny scrapbook pieces. And then the larger. So pretty. This is a more of a flower butterfly type one. And this one is more of a like pastel flowery one. I'm in a flower kind of mood. It's spring. When am I not in a flower kind of mood, honestly? Okay, we've got the bigger scrapbook pieces. More. Oh, roses and music notes. That's beautiful. Beautiful. And stickers. Look. So cute. All right, I'm going to put these back and we'll go over the last thing in the box. I hope <laughs> this is good because I have high hopes, high hopes for it. This is a planner. It's dry erase and it came with chalk markers. It's not magnet, it is stick on. So I can put it on the fridge or the wall. It's going on my fridge. These are more markers to go with it. These are metallic because why not? Who doesn't love shiny things? Those are the markers that came with it. Let's see what it looks like. There was very mixed reviews. So I was unsure. Hopefully it's good. I don't really want to tear this too bad just in case I got to send it back. Oh, look, is that, that's magnetic. This is like a bonus, I guess. So you can flip it clean or dirty for like the dishwasher. It has a protective film that you have to pull off. And I read the reviews. Some people complained about the markers not working at all and scratching the surface. And then other people mentioned, make sure you take the protective film off because it was scratching the film. can't see it great but this is the monthly calendar I really hope this works out I want to put this on my refrigerator to help me if I have this up and important things that have to be done on the refrigerator I cannot not see it this is the weekly so it's broken down by day and then it's got groceries here on the end the idea is 
to put my cleaning task in each day and check it off as I go. The ADHD brain cannot break task down. So that hopefully will help. And here is a plain one, just for whatever. It has these little stickies that are supposedly very strong. I'm gonna clean the refrigerator and put these on and then I will show you. But this is my organization stuff to help me get organized and on task. Now see with the, with the journal, I had been looking and looking at all of these, uh, my brain quit working, like house cleaning checklist that you can buy on Amazon. And there are little books, each page has the chores and you check them off. It's supposed to help people with ADHD. And I thought, what if I just make my own? Now these, I'm not unboxing. They didn't come in a box. But I picked these up at Ollie's Outlet today. These are Happy Planner sticker packs, planner packs. I have Color Me Happy, Productivity, Wellness, fitness and choose happy. I picked them up at Ollie's outlet, a dollar 99 each. I have never used happy planner stuff before. I have heard all about it. I have seen lots of videos with women who use it. And I seen it by accident looking for a pencil case or a, to keep all of my pens and stuff in because I take too many to church so it would help if I had a separate carrying case for the pens and whatnot I ended up not even getting a pen case <laughs> because I seen these so but I got all the cute stuff can't wait to get it done Thank you so much for watching. If you have any questions, please drop the comments down below and I will answer to the best of my ability. If you haven't subscribed to the channel yet, please do so. It really helps support. I hope to see you guys next time. Bye y'all.